Well, full suspension bikes aren't as efficient as hardtails. Yes, on some shocks you can lock them out or even add a bit of compression dampening onto them. So they don't bob around as much, but they'll never be as rigid and as efficient as a hardtail for climbing. Full suspension bikes will require way more frequent servicing than a hardtail as well. Now the biggie, uh, they are more expensive than hardtails because obviously the extra parts, you've got a rear shock, you've got pivots, you've got extra bits, and you're gonna have to spend more money to look after it. They are a bit harder to clean than a hardtail. Well, you know when your bike is brand new and everything's shiny, there's not a speck of dust on it. Well, once you've ridden the full suspension bike, it's really hard to get it back like that. Giving it a good clean with a brush helps. Obviously taking the wheels out helps you get in a bit, but to get within the pivots and things, you have to sort of start taking the bike apart, which isn't really practical after every time you ride the bike. So. It's not as easy to clean as hardtail, and I'm not sure you'll ever quite get it the same once it's been dirty.